Five o'clock in our growing Colorado. Progress can sometimes mean just keeping things the same. Well, Denver 7's Thomas Hoppo shows us how one important church in Lowry is making progress on preservation. This is a little jewel that's located in the Lowry area. Every town has a soul. On the site of the former Lowry Air Force Base. With a sole purpose, history. The chapel is owned by the Lowry Foundation. It was given to us in 1998. And what gives this chapel life is the very soul that came through. The chapel was named after Dwight Eisenhower, who came here um, during his presidency as Denver was considered his summer White House. A church full of memories for those stationed here. Well, it was my, <clears throat> my second assignment here. And then I got the opportunity to come up for the last three years before we closed. There were four chapels on the Lowry Air Force Base and three of them were demolished. But Eisenhower Chapel's soul was saved by those who loved it. What Mike's not saying because he's a humble guy is his humanity helped protect it. A now historic landmark giving it more life. It's representative of really the American history post-World War II. Remove some of these boards and salvage as much of the historic fabric as we can in place. So it's quite a project, $204,000 is the total cost, and the grant that we received was for $104,000. And this town has its sole purpose. This is a historical artifact in our community. To keep its soul. And it's important that it doesn't get pushed aside and forgotten and left to deteriorate over time because they tell stories. In Lowry, Thomas Hoppo, Denver 7. And the Lowry Foundation still needs help, so if you'd like to donate to improve the Eisenhower Chapel, we have a link to their fundraiser on the DenverChannel.com.